Hello sewing lovers, welcome to Style of Blender and today we will be drafting a very basic pattern and uh, this is for newborn to uh, six months old and this is a very basic pattern but you can use the same uh, measurements and pattern for so many different designs and in future I will show you how you can use simple uh, drafting or pattern for different designs so let's get started so this is my paper and first for the length usually um, I take a little bit extra length uh, the ready length is 13 13 inches and uh, 15 inches depends on your taste so for me I like little longer um, uh, is supposed to touch the knees but if you're okay you can take 13 inches so and for the shoulder uh, I will be marking four inches the length of the armhole is four inches the chest is five and a half inches now this is the basic measurements we need join all the lines but if you want uh, you want a waist fitting yes go ahead and a mark for the waistline uh, five inches but I don't take uh, measurements for the waist I just join my chest to the bottom of the dress so the bottom of the dress I will be taking is seven inches which is more than enough for a newborn to six months old but if uh, because I don't want too much flare around it so many um, at this this age uh, usually kids are either on the labs or sleeping in their blankets or if they go out with parents and if they are trying to introduce with uh, the other relatives or family friends um, usually they are on the lab and if you have so much fabric then it's going it's hard to handle it so I would suggest you to take less fabric and seven inches is more than enough trust me and from the corner uh, mark half inch upwards and then make a curve like this uh, so you won't have any um, pointy corners and uh, for the armhole I'll give you a tip how you can make it so um, take a half of your armhole and mark there and from there you have mark a curve make sure your curve is not too deep because uh, in kids uh, uni uh, they don't have a specific body type or they have uh, they don't have like a specific measurements you don't want to ex um, what should I say you don't want to do so much fitting basically so and for the neckline uh, I took one and a half inch and uh, for the width and for the depth for the back I took one inches and for the front I took two inches and uh, make sure uh, when you're marking for the back you are going you have to add a seam allowance for your zipper or button this I will show you in my upcoming videos how you can add those things but basically you don't um, I see you a lot so I just mark my patterns if they need to add hem or if they need to add side seams or uh, which side is going to be the folded side so these are the markings you have to make and uh, um, to be honest I see you a lot like I mean a lot and these patterns are really helpful for me I just bring uh, this uh, pattern whatever size I need so I just take that pattern out put it on top of uh, fabric drafted if I need to add anything I just do it there right away on the fabric and that's all and uh, uh, I will show you uh, how I use this uh, basic pattern for so many different things so this is it for the front this is going to be the front uh, drafting all right for the bag I did the same thing I'm just explaining you uh, why you need front and back for especially for little kids is because we add zippers and we add button so uh, if you're adding button strip uh, if 
uh, it would be a little extra but I will show you the very basic thing so I have the same uh, measurements on the other sides what I will be doing I will be just adding half an inch extra for uh, uh, my armhole area for the shoulder area and around the chest area I will show you with the different colors so it would be easy for you so on the front pattern we took four inches but for the back pattern we are adding half an inch extra so this is how it looks like and same thing you have to do around the chest area it's up to you if you are adding a longer zipper or if you want to add like a, a long button strip then you add a little bit um, extra around the waistline too but for me I just need up to the chest line and as you can see that's it so I I just join all the lines and as you can see it's just around the chest line it's a little extra the reason why I tell you is because at the back we open the slits so it, it would be easy for um, a child to put it on and we it's gonna be easy for us to take it off uh, so that's it everything else is per, um, as per the front measurements and that's all we added half an inch and uh, if you don't want to make two different patterns you can keep the right uh, front pattern and uh, mark all the measurements and on the fabric you can add half an inch or one inch of seam allowance whatever is good for you half an inch is more than enough if you are adding a zipper because we add a different strip to um, add volume or thickness to the fabric and that's it for this video in my next video i will show you uh, another tip of uh, pattern making please uh, go to my other channel if you speak Urdu or Hindi if you don't understand English very well and don't forget to hashtag style blender until next time bye